Hello, good evening, bro. Hello, everybody. Good evening. Hello, Miguel. Miguel Angel. Hello. Hello, Alex. Hello, Miguel. Hello, Miguel. Good evening. Yeah. Hello. Good evening. Hello, hello, good evening, ni modo, les tocó de nuevo. It's nice. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you? Fine, yeah. I'm doing good. A little bit, uh, the, the weather is uh, like really hot and humid, something, I don't know, I don't like it, but it's something like that. How are you? Fine, fine, fine. Fine? I'm happy because we're starting this course like really soon. We waited like what, like a week maybe? Yeah? Yes, a week. Yeah. I think it was just what, one okay. week. But why do you have a re different name today? It says Gerardo Rivera. This is my second name. Oh, it's your second name. Because I remember you were Sir Sirhan, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I, put, I, put, I put that the second name because it's the first class and and said, what is your name? What meaning is your name? Because it's your name. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and that I understand. Is, is more, I understand. It's more easy. Get out. <laughs> it's easier. <laughs> easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Okay, perfect. But Sirhan <laughs> is here. Okay, perfect. Okay, thank you. Marielos, welcome to the class. Hello. Happy <laughs> to have you. you here. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> thank you, teacher. How are you? Fine, thanks. Excellent, excellent. Okay. It's nice to have you guys here. It's nice to have the ones that were in the other in the other module it's nice to have you back here and it's nice to have our new classmates because i can see we have a couple of new classmates for example mm -hmm. if i'm not mistaken miguel lara is new Edis mendes no, not teacher no you're not new no but i don't because i don't see your face maybe um Oh, now I remember you. Yes, now yes. I remember you. Yes, very good. Excellent, Miguel. Perfect, thank you. Yeah, mm, then we have Briselda. I think she's new. Ibis. Oh, Ibis. Briselda is not new, maybe. But Ibis is, I don't know, I don't remember you guys. Maybe if you turn on the cameras, maybe my... I'm not good with names. I may be good with Gerard I, Gerardo Sirhan is uh, because Sirhan is like a yeah different name. But I'm not good with names. <laughs> but I'm good with faces. I can remember faces. That I can tell you. I can remember faces. Okay, perfect. So I'm really happy 
really, really happy to have you here again. And uh, it was not a long time. It was not a long wait. It was really fast. So we don't lose the track on, on the advanced or pre-advanced module. Something I was gonna tell you is that it's a priority for us at Inglés Corporativo to work with the advanced uh, groups because we want you to have your last diploma by this year so you can like graduate from the English course. That is a priority. So that's why we keep on going with these modules and that's why the process is really fast. Sometimes it depends only on the time when you send the documents because that's what takes longer. So the documents to be sent and then to approve them, that is the main problem. But I'm happy because we started really fast and I hope maybe not today, but I hope to have you guys here like all the other people that were in the other modules here um, so we can be together as a group and we can finish these modules together as a group. Okay, perfect. Now, I think that no, if nobody's new, you already know my name. Hi, <laughs> my name is Diana, if you don't know me. I'm Diana Sayas, and I'm gonna be your teacher for this module. And I hope you connect to the classes because sometimes you don't connect to the classes. And I remember seeing you a couple times, but not all the times. Perfect. I'm going to start. I don't know. Do you have access to the platform already? You don't have access to the platform already. No, at the moment, teacher. Okay. But did they did yes. they send the message with the information or nothing? Just they. No. Yes, we received the yes. message. You received the message. But the, well, that, that that's why you know you have classes today, right? because they sent you a message. But let's try with the platform, My maybe. Teacher. Yeah, tell me, Mariana. Okay, uh, I opened the, the platform and that I was confused because I watched that a video. I, recall, I remember that it was in, the, in level of model two, but I, I only opened the first video. Let me see. Let me see, I, I wanna see. It's ex section one. No, 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 it's different. I can see it different. It's different, but it's about the scar. Is it about what? Fred. Uh, it's scar about <laughs> miedo. Scares. Uh, history. Like, afraid, like something. No, but yeah. in the last module, we didn't see something like that. We saw something about the environment, you remember? The environment okay. and, and the catastrophes and the yes. tornadoes and then mm. the floodings. Yeah. Yeah. But I don't know. We're gonna watch. It, We're gonna... it seems to me. <laughs> it was similar to you? Yes. Yeah, I, we're gonna I, see. Yeah, we're I gonna see. But I don't know. Okay. No, don't worry. Right. Oh. You saw it too? Yeah, I remember. And you remember the video? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know. Maybe I'm going to play the video right now. Now I'm curious about it. Let me see. Or maybe you saw it in a module that I wasn't there with you. I don't know. This is the video that is here for me. I want you to keep on learning. So stay and watch the first intro video we have for you. Hey guys! Is this one? Yes. And did, did yes. you watch this video in another module? It's a first uh, comments about the scary history. Scary tales, his histories, yes. Mm, and does everybody remember this one? Yes, yes. this yeah. video is for the no, it was, it was not. I don't remember it. Let me see. You're not going to believe this. I just heard a story about this campground. Three advanced one. You what do you mean? What about it? I was just at the bathhouse. I had taken a shower and was brushing. So you remember what is it about? Yes. The story and 
for the things? Mm -hmm. oh, yes. I don't. That's, that's funny. Okay. Anyways, but the second one, I don't know. It, I don't. I, I don't think this first one and the second one are gonna be uh, the same. Let me see. Doesn't matter. No, but it matters because we are not gonna be watching. Let me see. Uh, I'm gonna play the second one, and you tell me if you have watched it as well. Find out what made Carol and Alan change. I was really immature. Part A. Do you remember this conversation as well? No, this one is different? Yeah, this is different. But ah, okay. The... Yes, it's, it's different. Phew. I thought maybe we're going to have the same module again. Yes. <laughs> no, no. Okay, okay, okay. So it's different. It's different. At least that is different. So, but actually that is just like an introduction video just to get you started talking. Um, welcome Milton, welcome to the class. Happy to have you here. He froze. <laughs> Hi teacher, good evening. How are you? Thank you, you're welcome. Fine, thank you. <laughs> it's, it's very nice, uh, nice, nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Very good, perfect. So you see, like, we're going to be like the same people all over again, which is good because we're comfortable. And to the ones that are new, maybe, or if we have new people, I don't know, it's going to be good because we all are a team here. Excellent. So, but in this class, we're going to talk mainly about two things. The first one is about the past. We're going to remember a time when we were really immature. I'm sure we were all immature least that you were a baby and you were really professional as a baby, which I don't think so, but maybe. And then we're gonna talk about time clauses, okay? Um, but first, the same, you know what to do. Maybe you didn't forget this week, send me the date. Maybe you didn't forget. The date, guys. You have to send the date to the chat. Only Marielo send it. But yeah, it's today. It's not Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, it's Wednesday. Right. I lost the day, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, I don't know. Mm. Some of you still remember how to write the date, but remember it's Wednesday the pronunciation, but no, that's not how we write it, right? That's not how we write it. Wednesday, because two people send already Wednesday, Wednesday and it's Wednesday, remember? Wednesday, something like that. 
try to remember. And also, first letter of the day is capital, and first letter of the month is capital as well. So we need to work with that, capital letters. Okay. Okay. So the date today is Wednesday, March 30th. That's the pronunciation of the number, 30th. Wednesday, March 30th, 2022 or 2022, as you already know. Let me go with the um, presentation that I have here. And can you, well, I already told you the pronunciation, but can you read the date, Miguel Angel? Wednesday, March 30th, 2022. Thank you very much. Can you read the two topics we have for today, please, Evis? Uh, 10 causes. Yeah, and the first one? I was really in May tour. In my sure. In my sure. Thank you very much. Yves. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Sorry that I interrupted you. Yes, it's I was really in my sure and time classes. Those are the two topics we're going to be looking at today. And as you know, we're in the pre advanced three, and that's my name. As you already know, it's Diana Sayas. Okay, um, let's continue here. Here, this is the first one. Do you, well, I'm not gonna read it. It's you that are gonna read it. Uh, Boris Rodriguez, would you please read the, the, the question? Do you remember a time back in your past day when you were really in mature? How was it? Okay, in my short. My short. Okay. okay. Thank you, Boris. Yes. So now we're gonna talk about things. Do you remember a time back in your past days? Like in I don't know, with your early years when we were really in my short? I'm sure that still we have some times where we are when we are really mature, but not as bad as we were in the past. So I want you to think about it. Maybe don't say something that you are ashamed of <laughs> because some things we can be ashamed of, right? Of our past and being really mature. But say something that is not as bad. Maybe, hmm, let's try to think about it. I'm thinking right now. Let's think together. In mature. Maybe in... Well, still in college, maybe I was a, pretty, a little bit immature, a little bit, but not really immature. But then maybe in the school, I was immature. And then in high school, sometimes, not all the time. I remember <laughs> when I was little, 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 re really little. This is something that I'm ashamed of, but I'm going to share with you. Um, I was in like in fifth grade and I told, because I was in my shirt and I didn't know that now I'm a teacher. Now I know that we teach and we are not there to, to, to make your lives complicated. But anyways, when I was in fifth grade, I told my teacher that I couldn't see the board really well. And then my head hurt <laughs> because I was looking at the board. And I didn't want to look at the board and I didn't want to write the classes. And she said, hey, and do you need glasses to see or something? I was like, no, I don't know. I don't think I need them. But my parents, they cannot buy the glasses. <laughs> and then my teacher called my parents and I was so cheap. And I know that that was really my shirt. But I was in fifth grade, I was like nine nine years old or 10. Yeah, because I went to first grade when I was five years old. So yeah, 
I was really mature back in back in those days. Or maybe when I didn't want to to write the, the, the classes in the first grade and I was crying because I didn't want to write the classes and the teacher was always mad at me <laughs> because I didn't want to write. I don't like writing. But anyway, <laughs> those those times I was really mature. So let's try to think about your times being mature and let's share with the class, okay? If you can take a screenshot of these questions so you can ask them and answer them in the breakout rooms. I think we're still missing some students because right now you're only 10. Okay, you're ready? Yes. Perfect. It's your time to speak, remember.
Nelsi, I didn't see you, Nelsi. Hello. Teacher, teacher, nice <laughs> to meet you. <laughs> I'm your ex, like I'm your teacher as well. Also. Hello. Hello. Hi, Nancy. Um, hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing good. What about you? Uh, oh, good too. Um, I'm eating grapes. Uh -huh, you're eating <laughs> grapes. Okay, that's perfect. Yes. But you remember me, right? That I was your teacher in the last module? I don't remember. <laughs> you don't remember? I was your teacher in the last module. <laughs> yes, of course, teacher. I remember. I was like, why did she forget? Is my face so uh, horrible? <laughs> I'm, I'm amnesia. I uh, amnesia. Is it? Amnesia. Did you say amnesia? amnesia. Yes. Yes, I have amnesia. <laughs> Don't say uh, that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so your classmates right now are practicing in the breaker rooms. A question. So I'm gonna send you there to practice with them, okay? They tell okay. them to share the question with you, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. Perfect. There you go. I um, remember where they study. I traveled in Iraq to, to other cities. Uh, uh, I am a ride <laughs> for San, San Miguel. In, uh, I traveled in, in Rastras in Cañeros because it's, uh, it's a, a park, metro, is yeah, travel here, San Miguel City. 
I am living in Yusulutan. I am traveling from San Miguel. I am, no, Luz, I lived in Yusulutan and I travel to San Miguel. Ah, okay, okay. I live in Yusulutan. I am travel for San Miguel. It's but a, Miguel, so you were you were doing the trailer thing in the lorries? Yes, like, it's a, yeah, I see. I, that's really common because I, I like I'm from Usulutan as well. It's really common that people travel from Usulutan to San Miguel <laughs> in ride. And the, yes. it, like the students, when they study in the La Universidad Nacional, they go like that. It's so crazy. And sometimes they come in the back of, of a lorry, of, of a trailer. Yes, it's, it's so scary. And many people do that. <laughs> I know that many people it's do that. A tradition. <laughs> yeah, it's like a tradition. It's true. That's true. OK, perfect. Continue. OK. Well, Actually, in actually, uh, this 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 uh, this one is continue for another travel. What was yes, the question? Uh, the student uh, is traveling in uh, in every day. Actual, every day. Actual, the student continue yes. to travel like uh, that. Yeah, they continue traveling like that. Many students do that. Sometimes they yes. do it because they want to save money uh, like for transportation, money, transportation, money, they want to save it. And and many people, if you can see, like it's really common from people, like for, for people to come from Usulutan to San Miguel or to, from San Miguel to Usulutan. And it's really common. So what they do is they wait outside the University of El Salvador and they wait there and they wait for rides. So when you pass, with your car, it's really common to see the students doing like, like asking you for a ride and you know that they are asking for a ride. It's, it's really common. And sometimes they travel in pickups, sometimes they travel with things, I mean, family they know because they already know they are asking for rides. They travel in trailers, they travel, they travel and you hear a lot of crazy stories about those travels. That's dangerous, but still they do it. They still do it. Yeah. Yes. One day I I I they they rob it. Robert, they throw uh, me in the street of Cuco because it's I uh, as I was in right uh, is I uh, the pickup is is stopped. Uh, three boys, four boys is uh, with arm is in canyon. Uh, how do you say? Uh, they is, put uh, a gun. Come on, come on! Is uh, <laughs> uh, in in pickup is uh, for my 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 brother is a student is. Uh, Daba Oro Anios. Okay, okay, okay. He was he had Jurgly. A problem. Jurgly. Jurgly. Jurgly is is very yeah. much Jurgly. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. dangerous. Yes. I don't know why they do that. If you were yes. going to travel in a ride, you don't have anything yes. value with you, right? Okay, continue. Is I come back. Um, I, was, I was ashamed to, to talk to another person or to explain my, my point of view too, but um, I think uh, myself, I tell me, I take myself, I have to, to try. And I, I remember that I participated in, in the cultural arts, I, I don't know, how do you say, recitar or poema, I don't know. <laughs> but uh, I, I, I remember that I participated in, in, in the cultural arts and I tried to, to um, uh, 
I don't know. How do you say vencer? <laughs> my, my. Um, defeat. Defeat. Fit. Uh, fit. Defeat. Defeat. Okay. Defeat. 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 Okay. Okay. Uh, I remember that. Okay. Thanks. How about you, sir? Um, another, another measure in my high school, and I remember we we went to meeting to to study to study. We went to to bed late, but the first the first partner. Uh, Started to sleep, uh, and the, the others and me, I uh, smeared, smeared. Uh, what do you say, manchar, smeared, teacher? Manchar, get a stain or what? Manchar in what part? Man, man, manchar with the, 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 the pen. Like you painted the face. The painting the. Uh when the eyebrows the eyes painting the, the black most and the put in the, 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 the put the the circle with with, with, with pillow oh my goodness <laughs> you were me <mean. laughs> oh my god and did the person get angry? No, it's, it's very funny the moment. <laughs> I bet it's funny.
Well, after listening to those all those interesting stories, because there were some really interesting stories, right? Uh, we need to go back to the conversation we have on the platform. And I don't know why, but in the platform, the second video, it's the same as the third video. So if you see in the platform, you're gonna see the one that it says 1.1, I was really much sure, and the 1.3 time classes, it's the same one. It's the same one. So um, we're gonna complete the statements or the, the exercise on the platform, because I don't know, the, the, there's something there that I don't quite understand actually. But yeah, we're gonna do the conversation and then we're gonna complete the exercise we have it there. Okay, now, um, I know we all had crazy stories when we were younger, Well, we still have some stories to build and to tell, but I think that's what is interesting, right? About the past, to look back and smile a little bit, be ashamed a little bit, or I don't know, just to be, I don't know, to feel like you have lived. I say that my purpose, I, I, I always say that my purpose is to be an old lady and be smiling because I remember all the things I did in my life and my grandchildren will be like, why is grandmother smiling? I'm gonna be like, because I lived. I remember, I remember all the things that I have lived and that's what is gonna make you happy. Anyways, <laughs> that's something just I, I, I always think about. Okay, um, now let's go with this conversation here. Let me share the sound. So this is what I'm telling you. Look at, look, look guys. This one here and this one here, they are the same videos, okay? Just for you to know, they are exactly the same videos. So what were you like when you were younger? Oh, sorry. What happened with her? <laughs> what happened? It's a wrap. It, it's a wrap. <laughs> yeah, it's a wrap. Find out what made Carol. Okay, here it says. So we're going to listen to a conversation, and the first part of the conversation we can see. But the second part of the conversation, we're only going to list it. Okay, so pay attention to the pronunciation of the first part, and then I'm gonna ask you questions about the second part of the conversation, okay? So please pay attention. An Alan change. I was really immature. Part A, listen and practice. So what were you like when you were younger? When I was a kid, I was kind of irresponsible. You? Really? What made you change? Graduating from high school. What do you mean? Well, until I graduated, I'd never had any important responsibilities. But then I went off to college. I know what you mean. I was really immature when I was a teenager. So what made you change? I think I became more mature after I got my first job and moved away from home. Once I had a job, I became totally independent. Where did you work? I worked for my dad at the bank. Another turning point for me was when I got my dog, Pepper. I know that sounds silly, but it was really important to me. Why was that so important? Well, I was about 11. I remember that having a dog, you know, he was mine, made me feel really responsible in a funny kind of way. He would follow me everywhere and was always waiting for me when I came home from school. Actually, that sounds kind of nice. I never got to have a dog but I remember when I got my first bicycle. That was a very important day for me. For the first time, I could go out on my own and go as far as I wanted to. I used to polish the bicycle every day and take really good care of it. Of course, that only lasted a few months and then I lost interest in it. First, let's talk about, did you hear? Turning point. Turning point is that important moment of change that is called turning point. 
like the turning point. So did you hear the turning point for the lady and for the man? Yes. Yeah. So what was the lady's turning point? When she graduated from high school. Yeah, that was when she graduated from high school, but then she mentions another turning point that is not in the conversation. Really. It's just a listening point. His dog, Pepper. Her dog, Pepper, right? Her dog, that's right. Yeah. She got a dog, right? She got a dog. Yeah. And for the man, eh, turning point, I wouldn't call it, but what did he say? About what did he say? A bicycle. A bicycle. Exactly. Thank you, Lorena and Briselda. Yes, it was a dog and a bicycle. So for the lady, it was a dog when she had to take care of the dog. And for the man, it was a bicycle because he was interested in going out in, on his own and taking care of the bicycle and many, many stuff like that. So yeah, what is your turning point? Do you remember a turning point in your lives when something changed and it was really important that that changed? No? I remember that for me it was when my parents, when I started going to college and I was the first time going alone in, in a bus. So I was going in a mini bus actually, but the public transportation, I was using the public transportation by my own. And the other time that it was a turning point for me was when I got to go to the United States by my own, alone, just me, nobody else with me, just me. So yeah, that was a turning point because I learned how to live without anyone that I knew, everybody was, Knew there, nobody was my family, nobody, nah. I was on my own. And that's, that was a turning point for me, I will say. There, was, there were people taking care of me, of course, my host family, but mm, nah, I changed. I will say I changed, that was my turning point. Let's think about your turning points. What were your turning points growing up? But before we go there, let's review the conversation. It says, so what were you like when you were younger? That's Hoven, right? Younger. When I was a kid, I was kind of irresponsible. You, really? What made you change? We all change, right guys? I think I always say that if a person met me five years ago, that person no longer knows me because I'm a different person now. Okay. I'm sorry, let's continue. <laughs> you really, what made you change? Graduating from high school. What do you mean? Well, until I graduated, I never had any important responsibilities, but then I went off to college. I know what you mean. I was really immature when I was a teenager. So what made you change? I think I became more mature after I got my first job and I moved, moved, I moved away from home. Once I had a job, I became totally independent. Where do you work? I worked for my dad at a bank, at the bank. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. We're gonna do this uh, practice. Take a screenshot of this. We're gonna practice the conversation. And when you finish practice, well, practice it at least twice or three times. Remember that practice is practicing a lot. It's just one time. We're gonna practice this. And when you finish practicing, try to say, what was your turning point? What made you change to become, to become more mature about life? Do you understand the activity, guys? Is it clear? Yes. yes. Perfect. Okay. So remember, if we're in a group more than two people, try to take turns for the conversation. 
Alex. Alex, what happened? Teacher, me salí que tengo una situación en casa ahorita. Me voy a salir de, de la clase. Oh, okay. okay. So, But is everything okay? Yeah, it's okay. So, so mm -hmm. Solo tengo que atender a la gente. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, go. You can okay, go. Don't worry. Sí, Okay, see you tomorrow. Bye bye.
sometimes I sometimes I think that I had to change more more um, my my abilities my myself to be more self confident because okay. sometimes because sometimes um yeah, I didn't I I didn't can I can't um I can't be self confident for the activity because I have to I had to speak with another people and I was a little bit shy. Okay. Um uh, I remember when I I made my change when uh, a teenager or, uh, and then I I feel the change in my life. Okay, I understand that. Uh, like uh, like me oh. when when I got my that actually job, I uh, my life changed. Establish uh, in this job is very good, and I I. Progresado in this company. Uh, improve, improve. Uh, you yeah, can say okay. improve or made a progress. I improve. I okay. I make progress in this in this company. Uh, oh. That's reason is. <laughs> Just right now, he went to to her father. Uh, because tomorrow in the morning uh, he go to Guatemala with him, and and I don't see and I can see for three days. They they live um, with both two or no just just for a concert. Oh, there is musician. Oh, yeah. and, and he go with him for help. Oh, yeah. Cause Hello. So we had a couple of really deep and interesting conversations. What I noticed is that there were some deep conversations there and you were talking about really important stuff. So that's good. Maybe that's good. But we we lost track of time. Do you know what is lost track of time? No. Oh, I'm going to teach you idioms, like how to say a caballo regalado no se le busque lado in English. I'm going to teach you how to say those things. So lose track of time is perdemos cuenta del tiempo. So we lost the track of time and we were speaking really deep stuff and we need to go. <laughs> okay, guys. So I will see you hopefully tomorrow. Okay. And I hope to see you here yeah. and we're going to have more conversations like this. Okay. 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 Thank you, teacher. Good night. Bye-bye. Good night. 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 Good night.